We're here. <laughs> it's day two and my official Hoji Cha Latte count is two. I also saw like a vintage Balmain uh, sweater. I need like a modicum of self-control, so... Good morning. <laughs> Can I just say it feels really weird to not be wearing a mask? But I just recovered from COVID like two weeks ago. Should be fine. But yeah, it feels a bit odd. I think in public transport, like I still will, or if I'm in close proximity to other people. For now, it's off we go. Summer rain on the window. Watch the time float on. Cool air flows of a mental. As I fall behind I'm so sorry for dreaming about the future Maybe I'll be better when we're old enough Hey, I'm sorry for dreaming about the future away what's there to do so many times I try but I just don't remember Fitzroy Gardens, enjoying a lovely day in the park. Really nice weather right now. And Melbourne's weather is notoriously fickle, so I'm going to enjoy the sunshine while I can. Watch the time float on. Also, when I was at Fitzroy, I stopped by this secondhand store or thrift store and I had to get this um, shirt. I'm going to show it to you. Another to add to the oversized shirt collection. I don't really have like a burgundy maroon shirt in this kind of stripe, so yeah, lovely buy. I also saw like a vintage Balmain uh, sweater. Yeah, it was blue, really nice print. And it was like a v-neck cut as well, which was really cool. But I really had to stop myself, so <laughs> I need like a modicum of self-control, so... If I see in another store, like thrifting somewhere and it's on sale, who knows? But yeah, this time I'll just go with my shirt.
summer rain on the window Watch the time float on Cool air blows a memento As I fall So I just had a lovely breakfast at Bake Mono. It is pricey though. The pastry that I had was $7. But I had a hoji cha latte as well. It's day two and my official hoji cha latte count is two. And now I'm heading to the South Melbourne market to meet my friend for lunch. Behind. Take apart all the good things Stripped away what's there to do So many times I try But I just don't remember I just had breakfast at Tori's. It's a good place for cakes and coffee. I had a hot matcha and the matcha was so rich that I was taking a sip of water for every sip of matcha. <laughs> So I'm heading to Campbellwell Sunday Markets now. It's something one of my friends who just moved here recommended me to go. Just gonna check it out. I think there's a lot of like secondhand stuff. So let's go. Watch the time float on. Cool air blows a memento. As I fall. I'm absolutely burning up. Hey, I'm sorry for dreaming about the future. Port Melbourne Beach. 
Like, this is how desperate I am for a beach day that I just decided to head over in the morning. As you can see, it's kind of overcast, but yeah, the sky's on this side are clear. So, yeah, hopefully it won't rain. Um, but yeah. So I stopped by one of the coffee places to get a flat white to go. And then I also got a little pastry here. It's apricot. So it should be nice. Take apart all the good things. Stripped away what's there to do. So many times I try, but I just don't. Watch the time float on Cool air blows a memento As I fall behind So guys, I'm now at Queen Vic Market So there's a summer night market here left the summer night market at Queen Victoria Market. It only happens on Wednesdays, but it's a lovely, lovely place for street food. Very, very atmospheric. If you're looking to grab a bite to eat, there's also like lots of shops that you can check out. So you should definitely head here if you're here on a Wednesday. Only thing I would say is that the place gets quite smoky, especially on the inside. So yeah, it gets a bit suffocating and you basically leave smelling like smoke. <laughs> who has the sky bus all to himself <laughs> which means I'm heading to the airport coming to the end of my trip really really bummed to be leaving as always but it's been a really lovely trip got to see a lot of my friends here I did pretty much like everything I wanted to do I was literally going like north south east west every single day I was maxing out my Mikey car every single day so yeah pretty productive literally ticked off everything on my list Save for like a, a few coffee places, but you can never run out of coffee places in Melbourne. So all in all, it's been a lovely trip. Now it's kind of back to work. <laughs> yeah, I downloaded a few episodes on Netflix, so hopefully it should keep me occupied for the flight. And yeah, had a lovely dinner already, so that's about it for me. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.